Hey y'all, hey! Welcome to my channel, Kelly's Crochet Adventures. Welcome, welcome, welcome to my returning subscribers and welcome, welcome, welcome to my new subscribers. Honey, I am so glad you are here today, right now, because I want to show you my finished object. Yes, I got the baby blanket done. I got a baby blanket done. Now, let me show you this baby blanket. You can probably see it here off the side, but I'm going to go ahead and bring it up. Here we go. This is it, y'all. Check it out. It is made with the beautiful Burnett Baby Blanket yarn. These colors are blue, and I have um, so many. Let me see. Come on. Come on, production. Show the colors right now. Okay. Okay. All right, can you get into those a little bit? That's not all. That's not all. This is okay see see that oh yeah that that's showing it there okay all those colors right beautiful now i know what you're saying what in the ham sandwich kind of stitch you got going on over there well let me tell you this stitch we got to talk about it it is beautiful it is puffy it is fluffy it is squishable and lovable and huggable and the baby might not get it because it's just that soft right but anyway, this stitch is the marshmallow stitch, you guys. Um, so yeah, I did that. I did it. Isn't it beautiful? I mean, what a nice baby blanket to play on or to put in the um, car seat or whatnot, right? This is a nice, nice baby blanket. And I must tell you, whoa, it is a little heavy, but you know why, rightfully so. This marshmallow stitch, can you see? I don't know, if, come on, come on production, show them, come on production, what in the ham sandwich? Show them the yarn. <laughs> let, me, let me try again, here we go. Can y'all see that? There it goes, all right, thank you, good gracious. Sometimes reduction take a few minutes, but just check out that stitch, it's beautiful. But let me tell you, this marshmallow stitch is a yarn eater. It ate up a whole bunch of yarn. The reason why this wonderful, beautiful baby blanket for a little boy is so heavy is because I use three 300 gram balls of Burnett Baby Blanket yarn and two and I will say two and one eighth of, of the Barnett Baby Blanket yarn, but 100 grams, I believe it is. Yeah, it was 100 grams, it was two of those little ones. So that's where these colors are coming in. So I'm gonna show you what I'm saying here. Okay, so, oh Lord. Let me see if I can get this right so I can show you. All right. These two rows is one the, the with the browns, the whites and the blues. That is one 300 gram, um, 300 gram ball of yarn of the Burnett Bank blanket. Blanket. The blue stripes is one 300 gram ball of yarn. Okay. The middle with the greens and blues and whites the each each um series of rows in between the blue that's actually one skein okay that's one skein of that 100 gram i'm telling you this is this marshmallow stitch is beautiful but lord have mercy it is definitely a yarn eater upper <laughs> so i say do it because it's nice and soft and squishy but just know get make sure you have enough yarn to make this happen for your life and the little person so you might need for me um let's see there was two little ones so i would say um let's see i use three big ones two little ones that's five skeins of yarn but two of the little ones the two of 100 grams and the um the other solid colors were 300 grams a piece. So you could probably get away with doing four if you wanted the size that I made it. So I'm gonna put in the description below the one that I actually created and how mine turned out so big. Okay, <laughs> I know, right? It's like, what is that? what is going on with that? 
It's beautiful, it's squishy, it's nice and soft and cushy, but we got jiggy with it. Me and my Linda Hook, honey, was it Linda Clover? Yes, it was. Me and Linda Clover got jiggy with it. We made this happen. It's very nice. Um, uh, that uh, hook calls for a tighter stitch, I believe. If you wanted to go with a bigger hook, you probably could. Um, I chose the L, it just felt, so, it felt more comfortable for some reason. And I really did appreciate the feel of it while I was making it. I was like, oh, this is fun. When the project was over, I was like, yay, it's done. But oh, I was, I'm gonna miss the squishiness. <laughs> but that daggone marshmallow stitch, beautiful, but it's a yarn eater. Be warned, okay? I'm telling you, I'm just saying, but try it. I mean, I was like, these colors are so nice. And this is so squishy, I got all the way into it. And I hope you can get into it too, if you decide to make one for yourself or for your loved one who needs a baby blanket. Okay, that's all I got for you today. So God bless you and may heaven smile upon you. If you need prayer, please put it in the comments below. Honey, if you are not on this journey with me, honey, come on and hit like, hit subscribe, hit share if you like, honey. Come on in here and ring that bell every time so you know every time I'm in these YouTube streets, honey, okay? All right, well, God bless you and may heaven smile upon you. Bye. <laughs>